Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial of multi-coupon plugin for the Magento 2 platform and in today's video tutorial we'll be showing you how the Magento 2 web store customers or the guests would be able to uh, apply multiple coupons within the cart and on the checkout pages. Apart from that we'll also be showing you how the admin can initially configure the multiple coupons for user at the web store front end by the customers and the guests and apart from that we'll also be showing you how the admin on behalf of the customers can place an order and apply the coupon codes within the admin backend panel as well so uh, let me take you further ahead and uh, before that let me uh, give you a small gist about this particular multi-coupon plugin for the Magento 2 platform so basically this plugin allows the admin to create multiple coupons that the customers can avail on their purchases. Thus now the customers can apply multiple coupons at the same time within the Magento 2 store itself. The coupon codes can be applied either within the cart or at the checkout page. Apart from that the coupon codes can also be applied by the store admin for the orders that the store admin creates on the behalf of customers. The admin can also set up a unique coupon code which when applied then no other applied coupon code would be applicable and the other coupon codes that are already applied would be removed automatically. So let's get ahead and let's see how this particular multi-coupon plugin for Magento 2 works at the front end and we'll be showing you the customer workflow uh, first at the Magento 2 web store front end. So with that let me take you to the front end panel first. So right now I'm at the uh, Magento 2 web store front end as you can see and I've logged into my uh, customer account as you can see here on the top right hand side and I have added one product uh, into my cart that's the crown summit backpack so what I'll be doing is to apply the coupon codes I'll uh, tap on the view and edit cart link that you can see here and tapping the link there uh, takes us to the uh, shopping cart itself and here you can see that on the right hand side we haven't applied any of the coupons uh, uh, under the summary you can see that we have the subtotal as $200 right now so uh, to apply the coupon code the uh, customer can tap here on the bottom left hand side as you can see here we have a link for the apply discount co code so we need to tap that up and we'll have this particular box wherein we need to enter the coupon code and uh, to apply that for uh, getting the uh, discount we just need to tap on the apply discount button so uh, let me uh, enter this uh, coupon code initially so I'll be adding a season 50 coupon code and let me tap the apply discount button thereafter and you'll be seeing that uh, the particular discount would be applied so here you can see that you are uh, you have used the coupon code uh, season 50 and the same gets reflected here under the summary as well under the uh, subtotal we have the discount with the uh, particular coupon code name as well and we have received a 50% off on the particular product. Now let me add a few more because this particular plugin allows the customers to add multiple coupon codes uh, for their products that they want to purchase. So now let me add more. So for that I'll just tap again here on the link. So here you can also see the applied coupon codes that you've already applied to this particular uh, uh, product that you have within the cart itself or for your uh, order that you're going to place now we'll just enter a few more uh, coupon codes and those will also be uh, visible here under the applied coupon codes section here so uh, now let me go ahead and let me enter a uh, flat hundred and uh, I'll tap on the apply discount button here so now we can see that we'll be getting a hundred uh, amount uh, discount here for this particular uh, coupon code that we've applied for our, our order here and now you can see that uh, under the discounts we have the season 50 and the flat 100 applied and you can see that the order total has reached zero dollars right now so uh, apart from that uh, the uh, customers can also apply the unique code uh, that the admin has created from the backend so uh, if that unique code is applied uh, within the apply discount code code section here then all of the already applied uh, coupon codes uh, would be invalidated and would be removed so let me show you that as well so for example if I enter here I'll enter mega 
put in and thereafter I'll just tap on the apply discount button so right now you can see that uh, the mega 10 uh, coupon the unique code uh, that the admin had set up in the backend configuration for this particular module has been applied now and uh, under the discount now you can see that only mega 10 is applicable on the order that we are going to place so uh, under the apply uh, discount uh, section as well here under the applied coupon codes you can also see that we only have the mega 10 available right now that we have a, that we have applied to this particular order so that's how uh, if uh, the order uh, for the order uh, we can apply multiple coupon codes and if we have a unique code from the admin then after we are applying that uh, particular uh, unique uh, coupon code then all of the other coupon codes that we've already applied to our particular uh, order then those discounts would be uh, invalidated and uh, in their place the uh, unique coupon code discount would be applicable on the order as you've just seen here so now let me proceed uh, uh, further and uh, let me place an order for the, uh, for this particular order so what I'll do is I'll just tap on the proceed to checkout button and here I'll just uh, choose my shipping method and I'll tap next button and on the uh, payment section here I'll be choosing cash and delivery or whatever the uh, payment method has been provided by the uh, admin of the web store and on the right hand side under the order summary now you can see the card total is there and you can also see the discount that has been applied to this particular order that we are going to place and that's for the mega 10 for 30 dollars now i'll just tap the place order button to place this particular order with the discount as well all right the order has been placed and now let me check the uh, order details by tapping here on the link so here you can see that we have purchased the crown uh, summit backpack and we have applied the discount on the same of 30 dollars using the coupon code uh, or the unique coupon code mega 10 so uh, this was how uh, the customers would be able to easily apply multiple coupon codes within the cart and on the checkout page as well so uh, i just forgot to sh uh, show you how we can apply the codes on the uh, checkout page so uh, let me do one thing let me uh, tap reorder and let me uh, choose my shipping method let me tap next and on the payment page here uh, I'll choose my payment method and here also we have the apply discount code uh, link and we can enter our discount code as well so I'll enter flat 100 and I'll tap on the apply discount button that is available here and you can see that on the checkout page as well uh, the customer can apply the discount code so as to get the discount for their order and here you can see the details of the uh, applied uh, discount flat 100 and uh, if you have applied uh, two or three uh, coupons as well then the details of the same are visible here on the left hand side as you can see so we have just applied one at the checkout time so it shows flat 100 and thereafter the customer can tap on the place order button to place the particular order all right the order has been placed now let me check the order details let's see uh, what discount we have got so here we have our product and uh, the discount is flat 100 for 150 dollars so that was how the customers would be easily uh, apply the coupon or the multiple coupon codes uh, within the cart and on the checkout uh, page to get discounts and how they can also apply the unique code uh, coupon code by the admin now uh, let me go ahead and let me show you the different configuration settings that are there for this particular multi-coupon uh, plugin for the Magento 2 platform and thereafter I'll be showing you how the admin would be able to place an order on the behalf of customers and how the admin can add the discount coupons within that particular order as well from the admin backend panel. So let me take you to the admin backend panel first for uh, placing, uh, for showing you the configuration. Uh, settings or the initial settings for this particular module so now I'm at the uh, back-end uh, panel of the Magento 2 web store and uh, I'll be logging into my admin account by entering my username and password and tapping on the sign in button so after I've logged into my account we can configure this uh, particular plugin so to do so what I'll do is I'll just navigate through stores and then I'll go to the configuration some menu option under the settings 
and on the uh, configuration page uh, under the web cool block we'll have to navigate to uh, the multi coupon sub menu option so uh, right now we are just demonstrating you this particular functionality of this particular product so uh, other than that we have uh, other plugins installed as well so after you have uh, successfully purchased and installed this particular plugin then under the web cool block you'll have the uh, multi coupon seven menu option to configure the merchant to multiple coupon plugin itself and here we have the general settings uh, for the same for the multi coupon we have uh, the general settings so here the admin can set up the multi coupon status as uh, yes or no yes would enable the status for this particular one and no would uh, disable it out then we have uh, allow on so basically here the admin can allow the uh, multi coupon uh, coupons to be applied on specific pages so you can basically choose shopping cart and checkout page if you want to apply if you want to allow the customers to apply the coupon codes on the shopping cart and on the checkout page and apart from that if you want that the admin should also be able to uh, apply the coupon codes for their own orders that they place on behalf of the customers then you can choose admin order as well after that uh, we have the uh, coupon quantity limit so here you can set up a number and this is the maximum quantity of the coupon code which would be applicable to the cart so if you have set the uh, coupon quantity limit as three then only three times the coupon code would be applicable for a particular order then we have the unique coupon codes so basically here you can enter a unique coupon code and you can add multiple uh, uh, what we say as the coupon codes here separated by a comma so uh, what happens is that uh, if this particular unique code is applied by a customer then if there are any other uh, coupon codes that are uh, applied uh, already applied to the cart then they'll be invalidated and rejected and only the particular or this particular uh, respective coupon code would be applicable on the cart as I've already shown you in the customer workflow there so after configuring these settings, you just need to tap on the save configuration button. Now let me show you how the admin can basically create the coupon codes. So for that, what you need to do is you need to navigate to uh, marketing. And under promotions, we can tap the catalog price, sorry, the cart price rules, sub menu option, the cart price rules. And on the uh, cart price rules page here, you can add uh, new rules as well and here you can see that uh, we have offer 20 to get a 20 percent discount 50 percent off on season sale buy two or more and get flat 50 percent off uh, we have the mega offer get 10 percent off on purchase of 40 and above so here are the coupon codes that we just applied at the web store front end um, by the customer so uh hey uh, let me edit one uh, one of the uh, coupon codes let me show you what different options are there for them so these are the basically the uh, default ones wherein you can create your uh, default Magento option basically where you can create your uh, discount coupon. So here you have set up the rule uh, name, then the rule information you can set up. You can make it active. You can choose the website where it should be applicable. You can choose the customer groups for which uh, it should be applicable who can apply this, this particular uh, coupon code. You can also choose whether it's a no, no coupon or a specific coupon so if you're choosing it as a specific coupon you can set up the coupon code as well and uh, you can set up the uses per coupon and the uses per customer so uses per coupon can be set up and how many times a customer can make use of a particular coupon you can set that uh, limit as well so and that uh, usage limit is enforced for logged in customers only for uses per customer you can set up the from and to dates uh, when for the uh, uh, for, uh, for the uh, for the validity of this particular uh, discount coupon you can set the priority then you can choose the conditions then you can choose the actions what should happen so under the actions the customer the admin basically can apply the percent of the uh, product price discount a fixed discount or a fixed amount discount for the whole cart so uh, fixed or percentage can be set up so then you can set up uh, the discount amount and uh, the rest of the details as well so basically that's how uh, you can uh, create the uh, 
coupons under the uh, what we see as the marketing section here for the card price rules and then uh, those uh, price rules can be uh, uh, made uh, those coupons for the price rules can be applied by the customers at the web store front end to get the uh, discount and uh, lastly let me show you how the admin would be able to uh, basically place an order for the uh, on the behalf of customers and how he can apply the coupon code so right now I'm having some issues with my internet so I'll just uh, show you the uh, uh, user guide itself I've also attached the uh, demo link and the user guide link so you can go ahead and you can check the admin end uh, demo as well so let me navigate you to the uh, section wherein the admin can basically place the orders for the customers so you need to navigate through sales orders and create order and you need to choose a customer first you need to add the products for him and thereafter here you can see that we have the apply coupon code option so for example we have added a free 20 and a season 51 then you just need to tap on this right arrow here and before that you just add the products by tapping the add products here then you need to update items and quantities here and then uh, you can apply the coupon code and thereafter uh, the admin can check the uh, order that he has placed and can check the discounted amount as you can see here and the uh, discounted coupon code the codes that have already been applied to this particular order for the customer and uh, on the other hand the customers can also uh, check the same so uh, for the customer who uh, for whom the admin has placed the order he can log into his account and navigate through my account my orders and then uh, for the particular order he can check the discount code that has been applied so you can see that we have the season 50 and free 20 applied to this particular order number that's uh, order number nine hashtag nine and uh, so uh, that was much uh, about the uh, multi coupon uh, plugin for the Magento 2 platform and I hope it helped you out if you have any questions or queries regarding this particular plugin, then you can always get back to us at support at the webcool.com or you may raise a ticket at webcool.uvdesk.com. Thanks for watching this video and have a great day ahead.